For more videos, visit forthesakeofeducation.com. All right, guys, let's do this problem that says determine the magnitude and direction of theta and, and f <coughs> so that the particle is in equilibrium. <coughs> so basically, you know that in statics, the sum of the forces is equal to zero. So I'm going to add all the x components. The x component of this 8 kilo, kilo newton force is negative 8k cosine of 30. The x component of this 4 kilonewton force is minus 4k cosine of 60. This 5 kilonewton force is pure x component, so it's plus 5k. And the force x component is f sine of theta. And all that is equal to 0. So when you solve this in your calculator, you get that this is equal to negative 3. 0.93 plus f sine of theta is equal to 0 so f sine of theta is equal to 3.93 this is going to be my first formula we need two formulas because we got two variables that we're looking for to get my second formula I know that the sum of the forces in statics in the y is equal to zero so I'm gonna add all the y components y component of this 8 kilonewton force is positive 8k sine of 30 this 4 kilonewton force has a y component of negative 4k sine of 60 this 5 kilonewton force has a uh, it, ha it has no y component so it's plus zero and the force that we're looking for has a negative f cosine of theta y component which it's all all the sum of all these forces is equal to zero so when you plug this into your calculator you get that this is equal to 0.536 minus f cosine of theta is equal to zero so 0.536 is equal to f cosine of theta this is my second formula so when you divide the first by the second that's what I'm doing I'm dividing this by the second I get on the top f sine of theta is equal to 3.93 and at the bottom I get f cosine of theta is equal to 0.536 the f's cancel out you know that sine of theta over cosine of theta is equal to tangent of theta and that is equal to 3.93 over 0.536 so theta is given by the tangent inverse of 3.93 over 0.536 therefore theta when you apply this into your calculator you get that theta is equal to 82.2 degrees <clears throat> so now that you have um, theta you can find uh, the magnitude of the force by plugging theta into this formula or this formula whichever you prefer and you're gonna get that the force is equal to 3.97 and this is kilonewtons final answer for the magnitude final answer for the angle please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help thank you